Good afternoon, Keepers of the Cash. Gary B, the Casual Comic Guy here. And today we have a new box to the channel. This is the Comic Chest. Okay, you can find him on Instagram, and I'll put his link down below. Um, he reached out to me about making a custom Conan box, and um, I bet. So we're going to see what this bad boy has in it. I can already tell you it's packed really well. Some Terminator cards, very nice. Let's see. The contents of this comic chest. Conan, thank you. Ten comic books. Uh, Conan inspired box collectibles. Uh, two of them. Two vintage action figures. Conan inspired. Hero clicks. Conan inspired. And a pack of cards. All right. So that's our contents. Nice logo sticker. Coming soon. And all right. So here we go. Let's see what this is. I think we're just going to set this down here and I'm going to pull from it as we need. I really like the presentation with the black pack. Oh, okay. So this is uh, Starburst. So a little candy to enjoy. Really uh, digging these uh, Terminator cards. Those are nice. All right. So let's see. Hero clicks. Now I'm not much of a toy guy, so. But we'll see what these are and how cool they are. I am kind of curious though, can't lie. So our first hero click is a rock troll. Very cool. I don't mind that. It's really not cool looking. Don't know if I'm getting it to focus properly, but. Oh, nice. Valkyrie. All right. I'm not upset about that. Valkyrie is awesome. All right, another Valkyrie. Very cool. All right, so those are decent. And we got another one here. Ooh, all right. Arcane. Look at that beastie looking thing. That, that's actually really awesome. Very nice. All right, so I don't mind those hero clicks at all. Those are pretty cool. Let's see what we got next. We got a vintage. Again, I really like the, the presentation. The packaging's really nice. I like the all black. Kind of makes it feel like it's Christmas. All right. I think this is, was the new animated He-Man that had come out. So, very savage, nice. Who knows, might have to paint his hair black, make him a Conan. All right. Let's see on our next, uh, I'm sorry, this is a vintage as well. And I first heard of these boxes through Slotted Up 503 and his channel. I've seen him open them like three, four months in a row. He really likes them. My cat's already getting in the box. It's not even empty yet. And also Chip Gettler and also Arcade Pop. So I've seen all of them open the comic chest boxes. So I know the values there. So it was an easy buy knowing that it was going to make value. Ooh. All right. This is absolutely incredible. Holy cow. Look at that. Now that's savage. That's amazing. Look at the detail on the back. Wow, that's fantastic. I have no idea what it is, and I don't care. That's just absolutely amazing. 
That's actually going to stay right out here if I can get it to stand up. Well, we'll figure something out. That thing's cool. And this is a collectible. Again, guys, just really nice packaging. Wow. All right. Ooh, okay. That's nice. We got Xena, Warrior Princess. Not upset about that at all. That's really, really nice. Wow. That is a really nice Xena. All right. We have another uh, bonus collectible we couldn't resist. Nice handwriting, too. Oh, some trolling. Some fun trolling. Conan O'Brien. Uh, Conan, Conan without borders. So a little play on Conan. Pretty funny. Good sense of humor. Nice. And then, oh, we got something else here. All right, we're going to see what this little guy is. Ooh. Oh, these are nice. All right, we got some Conan cards. This, I didn't even know these existed. This is awesome. So there's one. Two. And it says on the back, like issue 143, December 1987. So some good little highlights. Savage Sword of Conan covers. All right, this one's uh, issue 89. This one's issue 204. All right, issue 29. These are awesome. Oh, this is fantastic. So issue 87. Some of these I have as the actual issues. Issue 235. And then right back to the beginning. So those are awesome. I'm going to put these in protectors and keep them safe. And then finally. And I say finally because there's a lot of stuff in this box. We got some comics. So we're going to try to open this carefully. All right, and here we go. So this is listed as near mint $3. Conan and the Songs of the Dead. Very nice. That's issue number three. Conan and the Songs of the Dead, issue number two. Incredible cover. And this was a near mint, $3. Very fine, $2.10. So this is really cool. And this one is, all right, The Daughters of Midori, one shot. I got three of these now. This is a great, this one's in a great grade. All right. Conan, the Demons of Kitai, 4 of 4. All right, Conan and the Demons of Kitai, issue 3 of 4. All right, issue 2 of 4. Some more just beautiful covers. All right, and one of four. So we got that whole four issue limited. Very nice. Excellent. What do we got here? All right, Conan 28 with the Robert E. Howard uh, Centennial on it. This one, this one I have. All right, number 27. And number 26. So there we go, guys. We got two pops, two great action figures, four hero clicks, some candy, some kick-ass cards. 
a cool sticker, a pack of Terminator cards. I'm pretty happy. That's a great box. And um, the Demons of Katai, I have the trade of this. I don't have the sing I don't have the floppy, so I'm really happy to get that four issue mini. Daughters of Midori is a great read. Mark Texera cover. And the Songs of the Dead, just nice. So we got a couple of those. So great box. I love the comics. I love the pops. Win-win. Thank you, the Comic Chess, for an awesome experience. That was a lot of fun. I really enjoyed opening that. That was fantastic. So another look at our two pops here. And that's it. That's all I got for you guys today. Hope everyone's having a great day. And until next time, keep it casual.